Hello everybody and welcome back to Minecraft Safe Tech Ages episode 5. We're at the back of our mountain. I, I believe you haven't seen this place but we got all our horses from here. And you also remember the tunnel which we dug in episode, um, I believe episode 2, but I might be wrong. So, off camera I did some work. I upgraded the tunnel and now it looks more more of a human creation than just a hole in in the mountain i did some creative path pathway and i also upgraded everything in our home so right here we had some trees i moved them out of sight so our tree farm is over there then I added some paths and some, let's call them she a sheep pen and a cow pen. Later on we will get some sheep and some cows and place them here. So yeah, just a cozy place for them to stay. Then I also removed some dirt and I added some more machines. So last episode we made two grindstones, two horse grindstones, a chopping block and a horse press. But uh, off camera I added two more chopping blocks because you always need wood and these guys just work, work for you after you put in some wood. So these guys have been making some wood I mean some planks, sorry. This guy, yeah, he's done the most work because we used him for all, for most of this, most of this. Then this guy hasn't made anything. Oh, sorry guys. <laughs> I put four stacks of clay. Yeah, we'll need that later, but not today. So for the horse press achievement, I've done something else. So let's go to our first cave. Also off camera, I've collected some carrots, some potatoes and some beef. Actually the beef we had. So yeah, I just made this, uh, which is semi-automated yet, but soon uh, it will be fully automated. So just some hoppers behind the kilns and behind the grills and you have uh, half of the system. So you just put items here and they drop, oops, and they drop into the stuff below. This, the kilns we used to make some low grade charcoal from wood uh, because we'll need it later. I'll show you why. And uh, yeah, I've also been smelting food. As you can see here, we've got food for days and uh, some stone we got so much stone guys from the mountain we dug a whole mountain i mean not the whole the mountain but we dug the tunnel we dug those things so yeah uh, i also created some chests with more stuff in them but as you can see they're very small and also a lot of dirt because all that was filled with dirt so i removed uh, a lot uh, yes, yeah, some bone meal that we grinded in the past. And yeah, guys, to get back to... Oh, I also crafted the second backpack. So now we have two backpacks fully upgraded to stone level. One and two. So to get back to what I was saying before, um, I used the grindstone to grind down some charcoal. And this will give us the horse press achievement once the horse once the horse is finished uh, pressing down the charcoal into a block so yeah once once uh, the hopper passes 9 into the thing the horse starts going and we should see yeah there it is there you go if i pick it up i get the achievement nice I don't really need it so we got this one done 
Also, um, as you can see, there aren't a lot of flowers around. That's because I've been collecting them all and I've been uh, placing them into the grindstone to make some dice. Uh, dice, uh, I think you definitely need the brown one and some black one. The rest, the rest, I don't think you need them, but you never know. We'll see. For today's episode, we're building the tipi, which is a place to sleep. We're starting off with some uh, totemic uh, ceremonies. Hopefully I can get some cows, turn them into buffaloes and maybe move to a millstone. So guys, we begin with a tipi. The tipi is a place to sleep. Um, where should we place it? I think here is okay. That's a nice place, right? Yeah, perfect place. Can we sleep? No, we can't. Anyways, so this is the first goal. Now we get into the totemic mode. So you need a drum, but I'm going to build five and I'll show you why later. So one, two, three, four, five. Then that's the totemic drum. Then a flute, <laughs> a flute, uh, three sugar cane and a grass, which you can get by using the bone shears. That's the flute, the flute. Then I'm making the rattle. The rattle needs a jingle. So I hope you saw how you make it. And you just put it like this, a stick and a jingle. And we should get the achievement, I believe. Yeah, the rattle. So the achievement was to uh, craft the rattle, flute and drum. We did all that. But also to enhance, enhance our uh, ceremony progress, we'll build the jiggle dress, we, which, you, which you need. No, you'll need three jiggles and three strings. So. One jiggle, two jiggle, three jiggles. Jingles. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So three string on the middle row or top row and uh, below you put in the jingles. Smash them and you get the dress. Very nice. Which uh, basically creates more progress if you jump around while you do the ceremony. See? Did you see that music note? That's from the jingle dress. Guys, it's getting dark and close to night so this is our first time in the tipi let's go yeah nice finally this place starts to feel like home because um, you don't get the what do you call it the you get a debuff when you sleep on the sleeping mat you get like a heavy and some some stuff like that anyways you get two debuffs you don't get them when you sleep in the tipi. So finally this place starts to feel like home, which is amazing. Then this is something very important and uh, very necessary for the totemic ceremonies. So three sticks, two string, one flint, one bone and two sugar cane. And you place them like that and you get the wind chime. I'll show you what it does. You need it for ceremonies uh, to start a few ceremonies. And this, we don't uh, need it. No, we do need it. This is the uh, totemic uh, chisel. Hold on a sec. We'll just make it. So that's uh, two sticks and uh, sorry, one flaked flint and a stick like that. But we're making two. Why? I'll show you why in a second. So what do you call this? Right, the totem whittling knife. So why did I craft two? Because one I always keep as a totem base and the second one I change to what I need. And I, I'm sorry, but I don't remember what I need right now. Every animal is another effect and they do stack. I'll show you later. Bones, we got a lot of bones, so I'll just get rid of it. Also, you, when you get the this achievement, the shake, rattle and roll, 
you get the Totempedia, with, which you can refer to, to basically I've been through through the whole thing to understand the mod, but I'll show you how it works. Um, th these are the musical instruments. We've got the flute, the drum, the wind chime, the jingle dress, the rattle, and this we cannot get yet. And uh, we can start with, I believe we need to do, yes, we need to get some buffaloes actually. We cannot uh, proceed any further without cows. So our next goal is to find cows. But I'll show you what these guys do, the totem whittling knives, which are very useful. Mm, and I think, yeah, this should be a good place. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one I will always use as a totem base. The next one I will change every time I need to change it. So I'm doing, I'm changing, changing the animal of the knife by holding shift and uh, scrolling the mouse wheel. Left or up depends on where you want to go. And actually because it's been a long time for, uh, for me uh, with the totems, I need to, <laughs> to see the, to consult this, the, the manual, totems and effects, totem poles. Yes, this is what I need. I want some speed. So this recipe is for another mode, I believe. In this one, it was made easier. So guys, buffalo, very useful. Later on, when we get to the ore veins, I, I, I will always build a six, a seven tall totem with full on buffalo. But here, I, I guess we need an ocelot to prevent the creepers from blowing up. So there you go. That's the ocelot. Then we might get some speed. Good luck we don't need. Gives you jump boost, lets you climb wall, walls. Yeah, and I think we'll go with the... Sorry, I forgot what it was. The speed, the horse, yeah. Horse, oops course one two three four five and this should let's see does it give us unfortunately it does give us only two because we build an ocelot head but what you can do is just place one next to it get this one into an ocelot remove this one place it back place some wood back and put the horse here so that's six horse heads and this gives you speed speed three and this one protects you from creeper creeper explosions and i think the range is very small like four or five blocks so yeah don't don't be like uh, the creepers will blow up if you're here but look at this speed <laughs> that's nice I might place more later on, maybe. Let's do it he here actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And see if you have two. That's very useful because you go bomb, base, one, two, three, four, five, and six. And now we should be able to run fast almost the whole horse area. So. Um, the instruments, I don't really need them right now, unless we want to upgrade the flute. The flute, let's do that. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm laughing with how I say flute. Flute. The flute. Ceremonies. Basic selecting, same perform tips, blah, 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 symphony of the depths. I think this is the one. No. No, this is not the one ring ceremony, no. Yep. This is the one. So. 
so first of all you need to stand next to a, a totem pole and uh, I I don't like this location for the ceremonies let's get away and build a new one right here you don't need much mm. you don't but I'll build the full length <laughs> just because I can one two three four five six seven and two three totem base horse 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 full speed then what you do what you're gonna do is place all the drums like that like a so like a so and you will also need the fl uh, wind chime like a like a so then place this and this in your hotbar toolbar and I believe the ceremony for the upgraded flute which can uh, basically you play it and animals and villagers follow you which is useful but I find the lead or the weight way much more effective but we can try it as well so what, uh, to explain again what we're doing is upgrading the flute to a pan's flute which is better than this it gives you more progress in the ceremony and to do so we need the serenade for syrinx ceremony so watch to start the ceremony you look into the totempedia to see which musical instruments you need to click you select the flute shift right click shift right click and then you start going crazy guys you just start going crazy and changing the instruments <laughs> and jump around and change and hit the drums the more drums there are the more better the better the the meter goes up and you need to jump around don't forget that oops Well, that was a failure. Hmm. I was seeing a lot of guys having trouble with the, with the ceremonies. And for me, it was always so easy. But this time it wasn't. Maybe this thing with the five drums is uh, it's not working. Let's, let's try again. Shift. Guys, I think we got it. I placed the flutes in the offhand and the rattle in my main hand and I'm just clicking and jumping like crazy please please <laughs> please yes yes oh my god guys this was my fifth attempt so so jingle dress is a must rattle p f sorry flute in the off hand rattle in the main hand Click on all the drums and just jump like crazy. And this is how you do it. Nice. So we have a flute now. I'm not gonna demonstrate it here, but if I find an animal and I play it, the animal, hello, should be interested. <laughs> Well, maybe not this one. Hello? He, he doesn't like us. Let's find another example. Chicken? Chicken. Do you like this flute? What is going on? The animals should be following us. There you go. Is it following? Yes, finally. F Hello. Okay, see why I I prefer the lead or the wheat way. Okay, guys. So this is how the flute works. <laughs> it's 
sometimes like with the pig and the chicken it doesn't work but what I'm gonna do is I'm going to cut and I'm going to look for some cows last time I looked around there were no cows no cows but we need them so I'll be back when I find some cows guys so we found the cows but we also found this guy the guy that killed us he sees us he's on the way <laughs> oh my god oh 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 no oh my god we're so powerful just kidding just kidding yay that was quite easy so we got our revenge guys we got our revenge cows hello let's go okay guys we got the cows so come here come here do you want to eat you don't want to eat what is wrong with you guys come on oh it's like their new home nice um, now to continue with our quest we need to transform them into buffaloes let's get not all of the drums I don't think they they work that well to be honest let's see the recipe for the cows I believe it's the buffalo dance <laughs> yeah we need we need the chime the wind chime and the drum let's just get inside put the drum put the chime here and uh, so they collected you know what we're gonna do we're going to craft uh, a jump post totem and actually we're not going to craft it here we're going to craft it right here yeah so where is our we need this we need the base base and then we'll need let's uh, make three but I don't remember which one is the jump let me check real quick totem and effects totem effects rabbit we need the rabbit rabbit one two come on jump yay let's make it how much is uh, so that's uh, one two three four and we jump on the rabbit head no well we got a solution so one two and where's the spider spider we should be able to climb yeah yeah baby yeah okay two more for the rabbit how much can we jump now oh it's like two blocks and I'm also a spider be careful with that guys so back to business uh, there is a drum somewhere here there it is <laughs> that looks so funny uh, I'll fix that off cam if I remember so drum drum go to sleep and let's make some buffaloes also um, I was thinking of bringing sheep here but actually um, I might need to change this yes yeah, stop 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 we'll keep some cows and some buffaloes I think sheep can go in a separate thingy so buffalo dance buffalo dance ceremonies buffalo dance and also so let's see if I can do it first try first try rattle jingle dress get the jingle dress equipped 
and then uh, fluting of hand rattle but we go drum wind chime buffalo dance let's get it started yeah, let's go oh my god this is so easy what what the actual hell yeah yeah we got two small buffaloes look at those cuties guys look at them look oh my god they are so cute nice nice they're so cute but we will kill them oh my god how much can you eat ba ba boom ba ba bim boom ba bim boom boom jump around like a crazy man you can hear my keyboard smashing and my mouse smashing like crazy and this oh this guy is a big one wait that no guys no so this guy that we fed turned into a big one and those guys uh, yeah this is the new one so this one that grows crops the zafkiel walls totem base okay now it should be okay so shift right click on the wind chime shift right click on the flute go crazy sorry rattle yep yep go crazy yes yes jump around jump up to get down yes very nice oh 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 my god wow damn we can build a huge farm oh no i thought i'm, I'm just gonna use a hoe but we don't have any hoes ho 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 okay guys i'll be back when i have more buffaloes and uh, we can you know you know what we're gonna do with it i'm so oh my god i'm not i'm not done yet guys jesus i thought i would like harvest it once but this is crazy hmm maybe I'll, I'll do some farming i'll leave that here and do some farming offline and i'll see you guys in a bit okay guys uh it has been about five minutes i thought we'll do another ceremony um the rite of spring it's a quest as well i'm going to jesus you guys are big drop some wheat here and uh what do i need to activate it the flute the flute the flute and the drum put the flute here and start going crazy sorry i also forgot to tell you that i placed them saplings and it should turn them into red cedar saplings yeah you go crazy guys yeah nice okay so i'm sorry for everybody that is against animal violence i am too and those guys are super cute especially these little guys but for the sake of the quest line i have to do it please look away if anybody's bothered i'm so sorry guy i'm so sorry please give me what one tooth no guys we need four please for the sake of your children give me three teeth oh no guys we have to kill more i'll be back oh i also built this totem um it should give me luck three yeah the pig totem six pig heads um let's see we just need two more teeth one no 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 please where, where did you go guy i don't want to kill anybody yes i think this should be enough for one wheel but is it enough wait millstone oh perfect we just need one that is that is amazing guys that is amazing oh my god so let's do it um what do we need yeah four four like this oops wait 
No, that's cobblestone. So two cobble, two sticks. Then we'll also need some slabs like this. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. So sorry. So sorry. No, 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 no. Some slabs. So. Right. Yes, we do need cedar planks. I'm sorry, guys. Let's get it. Let's get it very quickly. Very quickly. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Where is our cedar? There you go. Come on. Come on. Zombie, go, go away. Go away, zombie. Go away. We don't need you here. Pig? Pig? What are you doing? Pig? What? What is he doing? He wasn't there when I used the flute, but now he wants to sniff my butt. Okay. Okay, pig. Okay. Okay, guys, back to the village. Give me super speed. Yay. Give me super jump. Yay. Oops. Oops. No super jump. Okay. Get some cedar planks, one more. Cedar. Cedar. <laughs> Yay, we got the gear. We got the gear. So I believe it went like this. Dish and dish and dish. Smash that boy up. Oops. Smash that boy up. And then then I believe we need that this setup and this but first we needed the grinds let's get one of those I hope I never use them again uh, so and this nice guys we got the millstone and we'll put it here because this thing takes so much food so much food to grant it by hand you get tired so much let's get uh, those bad boys back place them here in the stone chest we have no more space no worries we have another oops oops please no karate zombie go away go away go away guy Thank God it wasn't a creeper. Let's sleep. So, 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 guys. I actually don't remember what the millstone is used for, but I think to progress into H2. But anyways, let's complete these achievements. We need a wheel. Do you have any wood on us? We do, but this is not the wood we need. But we are covered because we got those guys. No, I don't want to write him. I just want to open the chest. Go back to the crafting. I need two wheels, I believe. And they went like a so. Like a so. One wheel, two wheels. Perfect. We got the next achievement. And we also got all this. And uh, we'll craft a cart and I want so this one I believe it transports animals or this one transports animals let's see let's see craft a card and access its in inventory by shift right clicking or craft a transportation card to move moves quickly um, we'll just get this one for now yeah there is there not uh, a big difference if we need the other we'll craft the other soon enough dirt um, Jesus we have a lot of dirt let's just throw it away
and this one too. Get those bad boys. So I'm sorry about the keyboard, by the way, guys. I'm not sure what to do. Like I'm just clicking it too, too much, too hard. And then a slap. Do we have a slap? We don't have a slap. Oh my god! Oh my god! Get a slap. Put it right here. Smash it. Get the card. Very nice. We have one more achievement. And place it by right clicking. And this guy, I believe, if you shift right click, look at this guy. It's like, what is it, a double double chest or is it a double chest? I don't remember. But yeah, this guy can move a lot and we need the horse to move it around. So, let's get this all back. If we ever decide to move, um, this might be the way to go. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. We've done quite a lot. We've built the tipi. We've got some buffaloes, some totems. We've done some ceremonies and we got the milestone. Sorry, the millstone. So yeah, I hope you really enjoyed the episode. Uh, I'm wishing you a good morning, a good day, and a good night, and I hope to see you back tomorrow.